Hello children, welcome to my maths class. Okay, today we are going to learn about place value and face value. Okay, I will give some examples. Okay, what is place value? Okay, uh, for uh, you will take this number 4682. Okay, first number, we are, first we are going to take this 4. 4 is in which place? Thousands place. Okay, so the place value of this 4 will be 4000. Okay, 4000. Okay, but the face value of the 4 will be the same 4. Okay, the face value, the face value will be the same number. Okay, next we, we are going to take 6. 6 in, is in hundreds place. So, 600 will be the place value. But, what is the face value of 6? Is 6. Okay. The face value of 6 is 6. That is the same number. Okay. Okay. Next, uh, we, we are going to take uh, 8. Okay. 8 is in which place? Tens place. Okay. So, 8 is in tens place. So, that will be 80. The place value of 8 is 80. Okay. And the face value of 8 will be 8. Okay. Next, the uh, this thing, the place value of 2 will be 2. That is, here it is in 1's place, so it will be 2. And the face value of 2 will be the same. Okay, 2. Okay. Okay. The for exercise 1.4. Okay, we are going to start this exercise. Okay, in this first question, arrange the numerals in the place value table. Okay. You have to arrange these numbers in the place value table. Okay. So, first number is 567. Okay. 567 should be placed in this place value table. Okay. First, we are going to write ones, tens, hundreds. Okay. So, after writing this, it will be easy to place it in the place value table. Okay. 567. Okay. 5 is in which place? Hundreds place. Yes. Okay. So, this will come in hundreds place. Okay. Next, 6 is in tens place. So, we will write in tens place. Next, 7 is in which place? Yes. Ones place. Okay. Is it clear? 567. Okay. Next, 6409. Okay, first we have to write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay, after writing this, we have to place it in the uh, place value table. Okay, so first number 6. 6 is in which place? Thousands place. So thousands is, thousands place is here. Okay, we are going to write 6. Okay, next 4 is in which place? Hundreds place. Okay. Next, 0 is in which place? Yes, tens place. Then, 9 is in ones place. Okay, is it clear? Okay. Question number 2. Okay, write the place value of the underlying digit. Here, what we are going to do, okay, the, the number which is underlined, the, we have to write the place value of that underlying digit. Okay. So, <clears throat> first one, 41. In 41, which is, uh, the which number is underlined? 1. Okay. Before uh, placing it in this box, first we will write 1's, 10's. Okay. Okay. 1 is in which place? 1's place. So, the place value of 1 will be 1. Okay. Okay. Next. 528. Okay. 528. 5 is underlined. Okay. So, first we are going to write 1s, 10s, 100s. Okay. So, that it will be easy to sort it out. Okay. So, 5 is in 100s place. Okay. So, we, we are going to write 500. In 500, how many zeros are there? 2 zeros. Okay. So, we have to write 5 with 2 zeros. That is 500. Okay. Next. 189, first we are going to write 1s, 10s, 100s, okay, which is the underlying digit, 1, okay, 1 is in 100s place, so 100, 
100 means that is 1 with 2 zeros. Okay. Next, 239. Okay, first we are going to write ones, tens, hundreds. And the underlying digit is 9. Okay, 9 is in ones place. So, no zeros will be there. Okay, so single number 9. Okay, next. 6279. First, we have to write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay, so here, which is the underlying digit? Here, they have given 6. Okay, 6 is the underlying digit. Okay, so 6 is in thousands place. So, 6 is in thousands place. So, how many zeros will come? 3 zeros. Okay, for thousands, 3 zeros will come. 6000. Okay, same here. Okay, so 6094, we have to write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay, so the underlying digit is 6. So 6 is in thousands place. So 6000, the place value of 6 is 6000. Okay, next, question number 3. Write the place value of the digit 6 in the box. Okay, we have to find the place value of the digits okay 6 6 okay first number 361 so now here you have to find the place value of this 6 okay first we are going to write ones tens hundred okay so that it will be easy for you to identify which is in which place okay so 6 is in which place yes tens place okay 6 tens means 60. Okay, 6 tens is 60. Okay, next, two, in 206, we are going to find the place value of this 6. Okay, first step is 1 tens, hundreds, we have to write. After that, we have to find the place value of this 6. Okay, the place value of this 6 is 1, it is in 1's place, so 6. Okay, next, 2695, we have to find the place value of this okay place uh, digit okay ones tens hundreds thousands okay okay this this six is in which place hundreds place so six hundred okay six hundred is six with two zeros okay the next the last number six thousand three hundred and twenty okay first we have to write ones tens hundreds thousands Okay, so the place value of this 6 will be 6000. It is in thousands place. So it is 6000. That is 6 with 3 zeros will be 6000. Okay. Okay. Next question number 4. Write the place value of 8 in 8483. Okay. We have to find the place value of 8. That is the, uh, in in this number, two eights, we have to find the value of this place value. Okay. So, first we have to write 8483. Then you have to write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay. So, what is the value of place value of this eight? Yes, 80. Because it is in tens place. So, it is 80. Okay, what is the value of, place value of this 8? This 8 is in thousands place. So, the value, the place value of this 8 will be 8000. Okay. okay. Next, question number 5. Find the difference of the place values of two sevens in this number, 6577. Okay, what we are going to do now, we have to find the difference. What does mean, what do you mean by difference? The difference is we have to subtract. Okay, okay. Which number we have to subtract? Okay, the place value of two sevens. What is the two sevens? Okay, 6577, they have given two sevens. First, we are going to write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay, so the first digit is seven. Seven is in ones place. So, the place value of this number will be 7. Okay. And what is the place value of this 7? It is in tens place. So, it will be 70. Okay. Okay. We have, uh, we have, we know that these are the place values of 
these two sevens. Okay, so now we are going to subtract seven from seventy. Okay, first you have to write seventy because this is a bigger number. Okay, then minus seven. Okay, seventy minus seven. Okay, first you have to borrow from seven. Okay, so this will be six. Okay, and the zero will become ten. Okay. Okay, ten minus seven will be three. Next, six, the same number will be coming. Okay, sixty-three. Seventy minus seven will be sixty-three. So the difference of these two sevens will be sixty. Next, question number six. Take Rina's car number. We have to take Rina's car number. Okay, in the uh, in the they have given some options. From this, we have to take Rina's car number. Okay, what is uh, what is the number given? It has two hundreds, three tens, five thousands, and six ones. Okay, so for finding this, what we what we are going to do? First, we are going to write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay, okay. First, what they have given? It has two hundreds. Okay, two hundreds means Two will come in which place? Yes, two hundreds place. Okay. Next, three tens. Three tens means three will come in tens place. Okay. I'm going to write three in tens place. Okay. Next, five thousands. Okay, five thousands. So five will come in thousands place. So five will come in thousands place. I have written here. Okay, and six ones. Okay, six one six will come in ones place. So write six in ones place. So what is the answer? Five thousand two hundred and thirty six. So we have to find where it is. Okay, first number is two thousand three hundred and fifty six. It is not matching with this. Okay, so this is wrong. Okay, next three thousand two hundred and sixty five. It is not matching with five thousand two hundred and thirty six. So this is also wrong. Okay, next. Five thousand two hundred and thirty-six, and here also five thousand two hundred and thirty-six. So these two numbers are matching. So this is the correct option, and obviously this will be a wrong answer because this is five thousand three hundred and twenty-six, and here five thousand two hundred and thirty-six. So this answer will be wrong. Okay, the correct answer is five thousand two hundred and thirty-six. Is it clear? Okay. Question number seven. Encircle Rahul's house number. We have to circle Rahul's house number. Okay, from the given options. First, it has eight tens, four thousands, and two ones. Same method we are going to do here also. First step is you have to write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay. Okay. What is the next step? It has eight tens. Okay, so eight is in which place? Tens place. So we have to write eight in tens place. Four thousands. Okay, so four will come in thousands place. Four will come in thousands place. Okay, next and two ones. Okay, so we have to write two in ones place. Okay, two in ones place. And no number is given in hundreds place, so it will be zero. Okay, four thousand eighty-two is the house number of Rahul. Okay, so we have to find this in these options. Okay, so first number is eight hundred and forty-two. This is not matching with four thousand eighty-two. Okay, so we will not uh, circle this. Okay, next eight four hundred and eighty-two. This is not matching with four thousand eighty-two. So this is wrong. Okay, next. Four thousand twenty-eight. Okay, four thousand twenty-eight, and here it is given four thousand eighty-two. So this is also not matching. Okay, next the last number four thousand eighty-two. Four thousand eighty-two is matching with four thousand eighty-two. So this is Rahul's house number. We have circled this. Okay, next question number eight. Which of the following statements are correct? We have to. Find which of these statements are correct. If it is correct, means you have to write put a tick. If it is wrong, you have to put a cross in it. Okay. First, the place value of three in four thousand eighty-two 
2316 is 316. Okay. So in order to find this number, we have to first write ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Okay. So this three is in which place? Hundreds place. Okay. So the given number is 316 and it is matching with this 316. So this is correct. Okay. So we have to put a tick on it. Okay. Next, the place value of 0 in 6801, okay, is 10, okay. So, first we have to write 1s, 10s, 100s, 1000s, okay. What is the value of this one, place value of uh, 0? It is in 10s place, okay. So, it will come 0 only, okay. But, it is given here 10. So, the answer will be wrong, okay. Next, the place value of 4 in 4,325. 4,325. Okay, first you have to write 1s, 10s, 100s, 1000s. Okay, so they have given 4,000. Okay, what is the value of 4? 4 is in 1000s place, 1000. So the value of this 4 will be 4,000. So this answer is, this statement is correct. We are going to put a tick on it. Okay. Thank you. That's all for today. Please do like and subscribe my channel.